With the 2014-2015 ACHA season getting underway, the Grizzlies are excited to get off to a good start. Yeah, I thought it went pretty well uh, this morning. You know, there's a good upbeat pace, good tempo. I thought our, our passing and our skill stuff was pretty good. There were times where it got sloppy, um, but that's to be expected it's the first day. Um, for the most part, you know, it seemed like guys were pretty much in shape. Um, you know, we, we skated hard at the end, and guys really worked hard, and, you know, they weren't loafing around. So I was really happy with it overall. Coach Shuffler says he learned a lot from his first season as head coach, which will help him this season. You know, the biggest thing is, is being on the guys a little bit more, um, being a little more strict and stern. Um, you know, I, I had a different relationship with a lot of the guys as an assistant coach, and now moving forward it's kind of transitioned a little more where I've been the head coach now, and uh, I can I can kind of lay, lay the law down a little more. But, you know, uh, being more prepared, game in, game out, practice in, practice out, and, you know, just getting these guys to, to buy into what we're – what we're preaching here, um, you know, especially about the attention to detail stuff, and that starts from practice to showing up on time, eating right, and going to class, all that stuff. It all adds up to performance on the ice. Head coach Gordy Shuffler knows the importance of getting off to a good start this season. Uh, yeah, we learned that lesson the hard way last year. You know, they're looking through our schedule going back in it throughout the off season. You know, there was quite a few games. You know, I, I feel like we there's 10 games in there that we gave away because we weren't ready. We weren't didn't take the team serious. And, you know, we gave games away. We weren't prepared. Um, so hopefully our guys uh, learn that lesson. You know, we were really young last year. We had 18 underclassmen, freshmen and sophomores. And I think they're going to grow and, and understand and be more prepared so that we can, you know, finish in the top 10 this year. With the young Grizzlies maturing, Coach Scheffler hopes to see results on the ice sooner rather than later. Well, you know, that's that's the one thing that we, we talked about all summer is, you know, these guys have a year under their belt. Hopefully they've matured and, you know, they did their off-season workouts and, and got better. And so far it's it's trending that way. Obviously we'll find out in a couple of weeks here once we actually get into game action and start playing some games um, and kind of feel out where guys are going to fall and fit in the lineup. Um, but, you know, it's it, it's huge having that senior and junior leadership since we don't have many of them. They're really going to have to step up and help lead these guys to show them what's need to be done. Coach Shuffler switched up the team schedule this season to have some early bonding experience for the team. And he also restructured the way the team schedules in GLCHL conference play. Yeah, I kind of switched it up a little bit this year with that. We're going to start on the road at, down there at Kent State. You know, quick little bus ride, four hours, stay the night. They can hang out together, have some fun, um, you know, get, get a good bonding in early in the year. You know, it's always a good thing and, and, and whatnot to get these guys, you know, bonding away from the rink also. And, and they've already started to do that. And, I mean, we've only been going for two days here. So it's, it's really important. And we also kind of switched up our road trips. Instead of doing home and homes with some guys, we're doing two there and staying the night over. So that, I think, will help in the bonding throughout the season. Coach Seffler had a message for the Oakland University students where they can continue to order their student section T-shirts online at oaklandhockey.org. Ah, uh, yeah, the student support is huge. You know, in the, in the past, we, we used to have a huge student section, and it, it was really rowdy here at the Grizzly Den. And, uh, you know, um, it kind of waned there for a few years, but hopefully it comes back strong this year. You know, we're making a real good push with our T-shirts, you know, 10 bucks to get in for uh, for the whole season to come in and cheer on the Grizzlies and try to cheer us on to that uh, top 10 in the country. And uh, especially for those Rochester College games, we need your support since last year they they had more fans than us here. Coach Shuffler tells us about the new additions he made to this year's Oakland University hockey team. You know, some of the new guys, it's it wasn't more so big overhaul. It was filling a couple holes. You know, we're bringing in Floria and Teal on D. Those, those guys are going to help. They're both very skilled, and once they get in shape and, and we kind of curtail them to show their roles what they need, they're going to be big helps on the back end. Um, with, with Saputo and uh, Seidel up front, they're both going to be – Real help. I know Frank didn't play last year, and he's getting back into it, so he's got to get a little bit of rust off. And uh, Matt Seidel, you know, he he's a big big guy. He's high high end skill. Um, he was kind of a, a late addition add to our team, and he's really going to help. You know, uh, kind of fill that void left by Kaliza for this for the time being here. Um, so we, we're going to look to him to you know kind of help carry the load up there up front on those top two lines and on the power play.